What is up Tasers? In today's video, we're just going to talk about this microphone that I got from 7 Rhymes and this is the Remo Mic Pro and it is compatible with my iPhone 13 Pro Max and they also release a version for Android devices. So without further ado, let's talk about this more and we're gonna do a lot of tests in this video. So roll that intro. My boy Tasers, welcome to Taste Visuals. If you are new to this channel and you're kind of interested in filmmaking, tech gear reviews, and digital art, this is the channel for you. So make sure you subscribe and tap that bell there so you get notified whenever I upload a new video. And to all of my current subscribers, thank you so much for your support. And you guys are awesome. And also, please don't forget to follow me on my other social media accounts for more videos, updates, and tips. Now, before anything else, I would like to thank seven rhymes for sending me the remo mic pro not the review but as a giveaway because i won this microphone from one of their giveaways last year and and i know i know it took me a while to release this video because i wanted to test it more and i wanted to know why they are calling this a pro microphone so without further ado we're gonna do some more tests and yeah, what you're hearing right now is a raw audio of the Remo Mic Pro and currently the volume or the gain is set to volume 1 and let me know in the comment section below how this sounds. So we're moving on to another test so stay tuned. So right now we are here at Tagaytay and uh, as you can see on my left there is a road there. So we're just gonna go closer to that. Again, this one has a built-in noise reduction feature unlike the other microphones that we've tried out. I don't need to press any buttons. It will automatically um, detect if there's any noise on the, on the background while I'm speaking and it, it will somehow minimize it just like a noise reduction feature normally do. And the transmitter is here inside my clothes because I can't put it here because it's too close to my neck and you're gonna probably gonna hear my neck bumping into it so let me know in the comment section below how this sound again this has no post-production and what you're hearing right now is the raw audio and let's see how it sounds with the built-in noise reduction feature again a busy road outside and kids Alright, so right now we are outside and we are here almost near at the Teal Volcano and we are still testing out the 7 Rhymes Remo Mic Pro and as you can see there's a wind fur attached to this one because it's a bit windy here so let me know in the comment section below if it is effective uh, sometimes there is a strong wind blows but right now it's just a normal uh, wind so again this has no post-production there is a wind yeah let me know in the comment section below if the wind fur is effective again my volume is set to one and uh, this place is not that noisy if you see the trees there over there as you can see there is a, a bit of a wind uh, we're testing out the wind fur that came with it so let me know in the comment section below how this sounds Again, this has no post-processing and what you're hearing right now is the raw audio of the Remo Mic Pro. Okay, so we're just gonna try to raise up the volume of this microphone. So in here, if you'll see, there is a volume button on this side. So if you press this once, the indication on the receiver will also update now we are on volume 2 and if we press it again now we are at volume 3 so now we're just gonna press it again now you are hearing the volume 4 of the 7 rhymes Remo mic pro so let me know in the comment section below how this sounds what else um, on this side is just the power button 
So if you press this once. All right, we are back here at the studio. Now, just to clarify, all of those samples were recorded with the volume set to one and I had to normalize it in post. Otherwise, you won't be able to hear anything from the blog tests. But now that we got that out of the way, let's take a closer look at the Seven Rhymes Remo Mic Pro. So here is the receiver. It is lightweight, compact, and feels plasticky with a tiny screen. On this side is the USB-C input for charging and monitoring. Beside it is the mono and stereo slash pair switch. And this is the iPhone lightning port. Now this one came with two identical transmitters in which you can attach a wind fur. At the top is where the mic capsule is with an omnidirectional polar pattern covered with brush metal texture. On the side is the volume adjustment button with on and off switch slash pair switch. While on the other side is the mute button and the USB-C input for charging the device. At the back, you'll see a nicely designed metal clip with a rubber stopper below. And it came with this stylish pin like magnet so you can hide the mic under your clothing. And of course, I would like to add up that this magnet is strong. Now just plug in the receiver and it will automatically turn on. Take note that this doesn't have a battery built in so it is powered by your phone. Once the screen turns on, a 7 Rams logo appears and right after that, the audio monitoring system appears. Which consists of volume meter, mute indicator, connection, signal gauge, battery level, and audio track type. To turn on the TX, just press and hold the on and off switch. Once the LED indicator is on, it is automatically connected to the receiver. Do the same with the other TX. Now you have a pair of microphones for interview setup. Now what makes this microphone pro are these features. Number one, mute button on the transmitter. This can be useful for certain situations and most pro version wireless microphones these days has it. Just press the mute button and you'll see the LED indicator turns red. You are on mute button. Press it again to deactivate it. Number two, the capability to switch from mono to stereo. You can separate your left channel and your right channel if you need it. To activate this feature, just press the MS switch and see the indicator on the receiver changes from mono to stereo and vice versa. Number three, volume control, which you can add from zero to four. Number four is the six hours of battery life. Though I haven't monitored it, it does have a pretty good battery life if you ask me. Number five is that it has a 164 feet transmission range. What is up Tasers? Right now we are testing out the 7 Rhymes Remo Mic Pro. It's uh, attached here in my collar and this is the range test. And this microphone has 50 meters of wireless transmission line of sight without any obstruction but I believe that this is not the maximum range. I'm going to use this microphone for a demo or demoing a product and I'm not gonna be uh, 50 meters away from my camera because that would be ridiculous. You won't be able to see what I'm trying to demo. And yeah, this is the audio uh, that is coming out from the microphone and it's kind of windy here and I'm currently I currently have the dead cat uh, attached in it, so let me know in the comment section below how this sounds. Also, this has a 2.4 GHz connectivity, so you don't need a license to operate this mic. Number 7, built-in noise reduction. Now, this feature is a bit subtle in terms of effect. The good thing is there is no distortion or muffled sound. Also, not having to press a button or to fiddle a setting is a good thing for me. Now let's talk about the quirks that I found and again, this is more of a personal opinion. Maybe in the next version, they can make the form factor a little less bulky or edgy. I prefer round edges. Also, since we're talking about a pro version, I think this should have a charging case included. 
Overall, this is a good microphone to have for iPhone users or even Android. So if you're a vlogger, a streamer, or you're into a short form content, the Remo Mic Pro is definitely worth to buy. I will definitely recommend this to anyone. And this is a good microphone with some pro features, making it more versatile and can be used on any type of shoot that needs an audio. Now, I will leave the links in the description below if you're interested on grabbing one of these. And that's it, guys. I hope you find this video helpful. If you want more videos like this, please, please consider subscribing and tap that bell there so you get notified whenever I uploaded a new video. Again, Tasers, this is Taste Visuals. Together, let's explore, learn, create, and share. See you on my next video. Taste Visuals, out. Oh, <laughs>